I see what old chaps and chaps it's game chap and buddy here. Yes. Yes, indeed, fellows, and I dare see we are now looking here at the rather fun and exciting special Smash modes in the new Super Smash Bros. on Wii U. My god, there's a large variety of fun and entertaining options on offer here, and we are really wrecking some people, as you can see, on 300% stamina right now. Okay, so this is a special mode where everything is crazy. Uh, huge, That's right. Yes, uh, huge life there, uh, big characters, all sorts going on, yes? That's right, of course. You can have many options, ranging from extremely high damage as we currently have here, 300% per fighter, instant knockouts, to, of course, as Bertie says, giant characters, metal characters, curry characters, and much more. Of course, now, we've seen these in previously, I think, in Brawl, but not quite to this extent. They've racked it up a bit here, haven't they? They certainly have up the ante, and, of course, the lunacy is still present. This is completely absurd. Oh, look at that! Oh, yes, there go. That's right. Well, yes, of course, they're, they're powerful characters, so it's, it's not as easy to knock them out. Well, of course, as you can see, it's just a shame, really, this movie's not mine. Oh, my word, the final smash has landed. There we go. That's going to kill him, I think. Yeah, I think he might do it. Goodness me, there yes. we go. It's just a shame this movie's not online, old boy. It's so fun, I say. Well, yes, and indeed. Tell us what you think as you watch through these and stay to see all the different things that go on in this crazy mode. There is, they're all here. Think. They're all here, old boy, indeed. They're There's many, many options, as you can see. That was yes. a 300% stamina match. Good as be lightning fast, I say. Right. And of course, here we're going to go for a metal and a curry or, um, and uh, we'll go for a heavy metal, why not, old chap? Heavy metal, right, yes, yes. Rock music, girl, by. Yes. Yes. This makes all the characters solid metal and very heavy. Lady Palutini looking somewhat statuesque there, as you can see, in metal. Now, of course, metal characters already are, of course, very heavy in themselves, but making them heavy metal means they fall like lightning speed. Ah, yes, indeed. So they drop like lead, in other words. They drop like so a they, stone. So heavy means just that heavy weight, you know, not so much size, but weight. And That's then it goes, right. as you can see. Yes. Struggling to get back. Down like a meteor off the edge, as you can see. And also, the other thing in this mode is characters won't flinch when you hit them with weak attacks, and sometimes even smash attacks won't make them flinch. A bit like Metal Mario in the original Super Smash Bros. on N64, you really have to clock them on to make them actually go anywhere you know. Yes, most certainly. It's like they've got lead boots on. There's not much. They don't bounce much, as you can see there. No, so that's like. You, I mean, what is it like to actually play this in, in terms of playing normal mode to this mode? Well, I, as you can see, I'm Lady Palutina here, and it's really hard to knock anyone off at all. It's so difficult to get. KOs because everyone's so heavy they hardly even move. I think perhaps the best idea might be to, be to throw them off, of course, but with four player chaos it's quite hard to land throws. Most no, certainly we can see there's not much movement there, they're so heavy they're all stuck together like glue almost. They're stuck to the ground, I say, they're five seconds on the clock, I don't think we're going to land any kills here, old chap. Well, neither are they, by looks of it, I don't think. No, that's right, entertaining right. all the same, they're quite unusual. It's Mr. Game and Water on that one, well, Did there you go. Well, this <laughs> is an interesting mode, so what do we have up next? Well, I dare say, that was, of course, heavy metal. We've seen 300% stamina. So now let's go for, hmm, um, a Rocket Belt Curry Brawl. No smash, I say. There you go. A Rocket Belt Curry Smash? What's that, then? This one has some rather amusing effects. You have to see these videos. As you can see, you not only get a Rocket Belt, but also Curry. We're on a lava-based stage quite appropriate. Now, watch what the CPUs do here. Just, just look at these chaps go. They're all locked into each other, you know. They most certainly are. They're that? flying out, chap. Look at them go. My goodness. Look at the sky, I say. I can see it. So what is the fire breath or something, is it? Now, this is the result of eating too much spicy curry, of course. Of course. You can breathe fire, as everyone knows, of course, yes, of and course uh, you, do, yes. you also have rocket belts so you can fly around and pop people like that. Now, of course, as you can see, Vanels, because the fire breath is continually firing, it's very hard to land hits because you're always taking hits from the other player, and uh, damage tends to rack up quite fast, but actually finishing people is almost impossible. Well, most certainly, because you obviously can't get near them. They're, they're literally breathing fire at you and knocking down your, your, your life as you go. And if you collide with other fighters, someone's gone down, there we are. Uh, yes, it was uh, uh, Olimar, I think. And of course, if you actually collide with other fighters, you'll seem to fly up with them because you're constantly dealing each other damage and knockback. Most certainly, so is, is, are we looking at all these special modes here? Uh, yes, old boy, of course. We've seen so far three. I think this is going to sudden death, actually. I'm not is sure. It? Let's have a look. Yes, indeed, it's us against Shulk, you know. Well, uh, okay, of course, which... despite the fact both of us here are on 300%, it's going to be really tough for one to finish off the other. We'll try... Oh, double counter! Oh, that was close, old chap. Yes, I can see. Yes, 300%. The counter yes. of the counter there, but neither landed. So Shulk's flown off in his rocket pack. Let's try to get him, shall we? Right, here he um, comes. It's going to be hard to finish, and we just can't land a good hit in. It's a constant damage all the time. Well, and here so... come the bombs. Uh, oh, the bombs! Oh! <laughs> Simultaneous, old chap. Oh, it seems to be. Who's won? Who's won? No, it's us. Know. We've won the day. Oh, we won that one. Okay. There we go. So well, there's an interesting mode. These matches really are crazy, and I should imagine great fun to try with your friends, I think. I think so, yes. I mean, crazy addition to the game, and rather fun, I think, with all these different options. You know? That's right. Now, this one, Bellows, is a bit of an interesting one, and quite a unique case. What this is, as you can see, this is actually a stamina match. So the normal rules of Smash are out the window, and this ah. is based on games like Dead or Alive, Street Fighter, etc., where if your HP goes down to zero, you lose. Aha! 
So, um, right, so what's going on in this match, then? As you can see, we're playing as the heavy man here, Ganondorf, dishing, dishing out some punishment, I hope. But, of course, you won't have your knockback increased as your HP decreases. Your knockback remains quite low throughout the match. Ah, right, okay, so low knockback and, and everything happening there with four on stage one, two, three, four, yes? Yes, of course, the key here is to trap, trap people with heavy-hitting attacks, or, of course, combos if you land. In. Oh, the warlock punch there lands on Meta Knight. He's going to be feeling that in the morning, I say. I think he is. And, of course, getting an item like a super mushroom like Yoshi's just got is not a very good idea because the bigger you are, the bigger the target you are, and he's just died as you can see. He's down. He most certainly is. Yoshi's indeed. dead. No, speak to me, Yoshi. And Metal Knight too. No, I don't think they're going to anymore. They've had it. They've had it, old so chap. They're out. So it's he... us against Charizard. So we're going down to zero and you see who's going to get who's going to win. Who we are we're Ganondorf, yes? Yes, another warlock punch there. You can also knock them out by getting them off the edge. Oh my word, the thunder stomp seals his face. There he you go. He does. That was quite powerful, I said. So that's the top to bottom then. Start at the top and knock them down to zero. That's right, and of course you can knock them off by killing them on the blast zone as well, but it's quite hard to do that with low knockback. Oh yes, most certainly is. So Next up, what do we have, I say? Well, let's go for a giant one this time. I think I'm in a big mood, old boy. We'll go right. for a giant bunny battle of sorts, old chap. Giant bunny battle. And why not? That means we're not only huge, we can also jump super high. Ah, right, uh, right, okay, so we're, we're large now, and... There we are, as you can see. Yes, very large, and wearing those bunny ears. They're quite good, you know. Of course, they mean you can jump super high, as I say, and also move fast. Right, okay, so do we get any uh, greater damage or uh, hits because we're larger? Are they hits more powerful? Oh, yes, Samus can hit people a lot harder while, whilst giant like that, but of course the thing is, because everyone's giant, your knockback, or your launch uh, velocity, distance you travel once you're hit is also reduced because you're a bit chunkier than before. Oh, I see, so you have to take that into account then when you're yes. hitting people. So it might perhaps oh, cancel yes, each oh. other out a bit. You have increased punching power, but uh, your damage will go up faster, but will you travel as far on your launch? I'm not sure, old boy. Well, yes, we have to see. So, Ness is on his way out. Ness is on his way out, I think. Let's have a look. He is. He's, he's holding on for dear life, though, El Chapman. Yes, Again, but... it's quite hard to finish them whilst they've got bunny hoods on because, of course, they're all so fast. They do, and they're jumping so high. Anyway. Let's catch that smash ball, shall we, if we can, and try and get ready. Right. So, uh, oh my word, only seven seconds on the clock. This is ending fast, El Why Hurry up, Sam, a score, my dear. Here, Here he comes. Goes. Is this Riddles? It's Riddles, and there goes <laughs> the gunship. And Riddles is big, but we're big too this time, and uh, that's it. The match is over. Oh, is that quick? That fast. These it are just. One minute matches, of course, and let's see, oh, yeah. it's... Ah, yes, indeed, we've got the win again. We've got the win. Ah, ha, ha. Love this. So, of course, the giant battlefield is rather fun, but, of course, what's the opposite of the giant battle, old chap? Got to be smaller. The mini battle, of course, the with flowers battle. on your heads, because that's what you wear, old chap. Of course you do. You wear flowers on your heads in this one. So, as I said, this is a completely different challenge, or well, challenges, compared to the normal Smash. There's a flower bouncer, shall we say. Now, yes. flower power is not just for show. As you can see, look at those damage counters, fellows. That's right, when you've got the flower power on, your damage will continually increase, because for some reason, flowers do that to you. I don't know why. Well, I don't know. So, this mode here, is it just against the CPU, as it were, or can you go online and do this mode with others? Tragically, old boy, you don't seem to be able to go online with Special Smash yet, but maybe, we just don't know, maybe they'll add that in a future DLC update. Well, exactly. I, was going to I say do that. hope they will do. Well, yes, I was going to say that with all the talks of DLC, then they could well perhaps you know add this. Look at that! But yes, he's still up there, old chap. There Look he goes. There. Yes, so that you can play against players perhaps in the future. We we'll have to wait and see. I hope so. It's a very fun mode that adds yes. a lot of variety to the game, and of course would be ideal in for fun mode. I think. Yes, I think that'd be a good idea. Look at those percentages. Someone's gone down. No two of them. Bowser's just well, surely dishing out some fury today. Well, they're going like crazy. They are, of course. They do travel a very long way, but because you're so small, it's so hard to hit each other. I just can't land those hits, old chap. Hard well, at all. Well, yes, hard, hard to land them because they're so small, as you say. Yes, can't get your fist on them. A small target. That's right. Hard to hit. But let's see. Have we got a boy? Bowser. There we are. Bowser. He's a happy chap, you know. Yes, he is now. Well, battles, we've had giant, we've had mini, we've had super fast, or no, have we had fast? I'm not sure, fast, but anyway, no, let's see what we have next. Let's have, oh, this is absolutely crazy, battles. It's a clear light battle. Oh, clear? Which clear. means what? Well, you can see, oh boy, everyone's got the cloaking device equipped. So you can't see who's, you can't see what you're hitting, and no. uh, or, or how you're hitting, or anything. This, battles, is all about keeping an eye on where you might be, and using your character's part of the, particle rather effects to find out where you are. There's no name tag, it doesn't say Game Jam or Player 2, it just has these, these shapes floating around. So what you'll have to do is use things like your projectiles, or your hitbox, or particle effects, wind gusts, etc., to find out where you are. Ah, so you don't know where you are, it's complete guesswork, in other words. Almost. It's a lot of guesswork, but I, I do wonder, do the CPUs cheat, El Chat? Do well, they all it, know where you are? Well, that's the thing. We wouldn't know. Uh, they probably do know where they are. We don't know, but we I'm guess they know where they are. I'm guessing they might do, but we've certainly got a jiggly, a jiggly puff there up to 93% damage. Can we finish her? Well, I don't know because I haven't got a clue where she is. No, that's the thing. I suppose you somehow just have to think or imagine you're stationary or moving about in the middle somewhere, because if you go too far to the left or right, we'll be straight off. We got jiggly, I think, but did you got the did final plan? You must become one with the Smash Brothers, old boy. Ah, uh, one with the 
Super Smash Bros. I see, yes. I yes. think so, is that right? Something, uh, like something like that. And it worked for us, as you can see. Yeah, there he is. Yes. So it's possible to win videos, but you've got to be crafty in that one more so than anywhere else. Well, most certainly, that, that one is a quite a twist, we can't even see what you're doing. Exactly, clear. And of course, I missed the cloaking device for Melee, actually. They should bring that item back, I think. Yeah, but uh, do, yes. anyway, this yeah. is, of course, the Raccoon Tail, a super fast Raccoon Tail battle. Right, so this means everything's fast and we can fly as well or float. There she is with her, her fetching little Tanuki tail. Now, of course, the yes. Tanuki is based on Super Mario Brothers 3, and mm. everyone gets Tanuki ears and a Tanuki tail. That, of course, means you can also fly in midair, or at least float down to the ground down, this, using this item. And, of course, everything's going faster than usual. Right, so there's going to be a lot of midair attacks, presumably, since everyone can float now. Or well, float slower. you would think so, although, of course, little Mac, if he was playing this mode, wouldn't want to use that. Oh dear, throws oh, his the mushroom there. Now, of course, because you have that ability to float, it means you have a much better high recovery option. You can just float all the way over to the stage and if you do have a, a character who has a poor recovery, this is ideal for getting back on stage. Yes, and I suppose perhaps for doing down attacks as it were. Indeed, oh boy, that's right. Aerial attacks, of course, will benefit from this. But uh, as you can see, though, it does develop rather more into a bit of a smash fest, I think, with four players. Let's try and get that flag, shall we, for goodness sake? Well, yes, yes, I suppose it does, yes, indeed. So, yes, of course, uh, you have not only the uh, raccoon tail, though, as you were saying, but also it's faster. Now, for some reason, it doesn't seem hugely faster in this one, maybe because it's four players, oh boy, I don't know. But it, it's supposed to go a lot faster in this mode. Well, yes, it could be that. Is it a bug, old boy? I'm not well, sure. It's hard to say, tell me. Is it yeah. going faster than all? I can't well, it tell. Could be, it could be, yes, it could be, because they're floating, you see, that's slow them down when they're in the air, so it's giving you effect of perhaps not as fast. Hmm, it might be, I am not sure. Oh my word, Zelda's boot didn't work that time. Good, I think that's been nerfed, that move, well, it's a lot been. stronger than it was, you know. Yes, yes, anyway, of course, I think this one's going to sudden death as well. There's been no kills yet. No, not yet, no. Hard to land those kills against those moving targets with the raccoon leaf, you'll see. Most certainly. So, let's the see whole feel of the thing is different. I mean, it is faster, I think, but yes. also because of the floating, it sort of adds that... Oh, that floating. was fast! Goodness me, look at that! And his Link... Uh, oh no, Link is caught on the arm slash, my word! Well, there we are, we lost that one, but We lost mind. that one, it's a shame and disgrace, goodness me, oh, there he is, well, okay, well, so that one is of course very fast, you've got to be sharpened on your toes for that one, I see, so let's see where we go now, right, we've okay, just had one. that, so we'll have a mega back shield, 300% fixed camera brawl, smash your right. down! Mega back shield, meaning what, we're big enough? You're all huge, you've got a back shield, which, which reflects attacks, of course, you're right. at 300%, and the camera's fixed and doesn't move. Oh, so it's almost, it's almost like modded smash brothers, almost. It really is like modded smash, as you can see, if you hit that back shield, You'll be the attack, rather, is reflecting back onto you now. Can Robin win the day? That's a question, I say. Ah, oh, most certainly. Look at Magnus down there. He's of an assist trophy, but we've. Oh, oh I say, have we? Uh, oh, yes, we killed Magnus, old chap. You yes, we that. You see, that's the back smash there, completely different thing. You can't get up behind people, you just get hit them and you just get smacked yourself. That's right. Poor little Magnus, the assist trophy, he was not powerful enough to withstand these characters' attacks. Sir. But let's see what he can do here. I think we're behind at the moment, boy. We'll have to pull something out the bag, but anything can change in this mode, you know. Well, yes, I suppose it can, yes, indeed. I think the dash attack's good here, old boy, and also the smash. Let's see what we can do. Let's catch some people with dashes. No, we missed him, but we got him. There we go. That's oh, better. Goes, three that. kills, just like that. One, two, and three. Most certainly, so we got Now, can you see? Oh, Sonic oh. gets triple kill, my, my word! word. Goodness yes. me! There he goes! Goodness me! It's triple kill! And double kill from us though, not too bad, not oh, too bad! Man, so that's how fast this smash can go, and have we won? I'm not sure. Let's have a look. Yes, we have! Yes, we did, so it's pure chaos. So, so can you set this, these modes, on difficulties? Easy, hard, mega hard, or whatever? Oh, you can! You can set the CPUs on these modes on all sorts, yeah. indeed. And this is quite an interesting technical one, this next one. This, of course, gives everyone Samus' screw attack, and also Fox's reflector, but of course you don't actually need to use a move in order to get the Reflection. It means, of course, anything that hits another fighter is bounced back to you. Ah, right. But what happens, old oh boy? What happens if two fighters stand facing each other and one shoots a projectile? Let's find out, shall we? Right. Uh, let's try him uh, like that. Oh, it comes out and hits you instead. It, ah, it's so ping that's pong. Ball. Yes, it's indeed. Like, you say, it's like a ping pong ball, mate. There's a five, uh, it seems five uh, passes of the ball, as it were, before it bounces back and hits you with increased power. So watch that. Look at that screw attack on King DDD oh, there. Yes, yes. Very powerful, I say. Can we get that final smash ball, I wonder? But anyway, as you can see, videos, projectiles in this particular game are all but useless. Oh, the ninja's final smash, oh, nothing. And if you're playing as someone like Captain Falcon or Gandalf who don't have a projectile attack, you will yes. be an advantage in this mode. Yes, I suppose you would. So, once again, a sort of strategic mode there, in a way. The ninja's going to have to pay for that, I think, oh, I I'm not going to take that to just uh, look lying down, you know. No, Let's no. see if we can get him. I, but no, I, I, he's running away from his old boy. Yeah, Only a smash can do the trick now. Can we, yeah. Dad? Can I'm not it? 
Come on, Samus, smash him away. Come three on, girl. Seconds. There we go. Oh, within what? Three, two seconds, I think. One second left, but he still yes. won the game. What a shame. He did. Well, yeah, never mind. But of course, as we've shown you some individual modes, but now it's time to go absolutely crazy. And that's ah. exactly what we're going to do. Is it what? A 300% Mega Money Metal Gunny Heavy Fast Angle Smash you now. One of those. One what? of those, I say. A 300%. Look at her. She's bloody absurd, you know. Mega. So she's mega. She's large. She's got the bunnies. Plus the. Uh, plus the curry. The plus the weight. Plus the curry. Everything in one hit. Don't trust. Dodgy curries, fellas. They are bad for you, as you can see. Well, what the hell is going on here, Elf Chef? <laughs> what is going on here? This is good. This is my word. You can't even see what's going on. I can't even move. I, I can see that. Yes. It, what it, is this, Elf Chef? You just press a button and hope, I think. I, I got I got with the beams on. Look at that. Yeah, you, you did, yes. You don't seems, know how, but you did. If you do go in this mode of complete lunacy, fellas, try to get a weapon that's got some power over a distance, like a sword, and just clobber people with it, I say. It'd be hard to say you're a pro player in this mode, wouldn't it, really? Oh, yes, yeah, smash pros play this mode. It's yes. totally legal, you know. Totally oh, I'm legal. sure. Sure it is, yes. So, uh, yes, there's a close-up of the complete carnage, as you can see. Every tick that goes by, they're pelting each other with this fire, and of course, because they're metal, they're hardly moving the knockback. So it's, it's really madness, you know. Yes, look at those percentages. Look, just ridiculous. I've got the gunship. There we are. But of course, my, my gunship attacks aren't even touching them, as you can see. Hardly. Oh, mind you, though, I, I spoke too soon. Well, not not too bad. Yes. Oh, no, no. Quite strong. Quite no, strong. Yes, you did then. It must be the high damage, I suppose. Well, I suppose it is, yes. So this mode, fellas, really epitomises what the special smash is all about. Complete Smash Brothers lunacy. Look at that smash fest there, Elf Chef. Yes, I think you're right there. It's complete madness. The whole thing in varying degrees. Choose your degree of madness and lunacy you want and just plug it in and start playing. I really like this mode, I think it's got a lot of potential offline and I do hope one day it'll be added as an option in online play for fun. Yes, I think so. Yes, playing against other players in this crazy mode would be a good addition, and I'm sure the chaps and chapits listening would agree. Yes, and Samus has the day. My favourite has to be the special a giant bunny metal curry smash old boy. I like that. The giant, I the giant bunny metal curry smash. It's marvellous, I say. Yes, there you go, everybody. Super Smash Bros. Wii U in oh, special yeah. smash. Join us again, I say, for more exciting Nintendo and Super Smash Bros. content. We look forward to seeing you then. Until then.